The Yu-Gi-Oh! Master of League of Legends. To counter him, pick the Blue Eyes White Dragon, also known as Fizz. Since with a Z, he'll be able to dodge his card and engage right after for a defenseless TF. Diana, if she manages to push him into his tower early, can completely wreck him post 6, and will always stop his ult with her E. Yasuo's Wind Wall is also able to deny every single one of his attacks, so he's right up there as one of the best counters. Kassadin, who can ult away right after getting stunned, LeBlanc, who can abuse his lack of mobility, and Ziggs, who can perma push and prevent him from ulting, make other good counters as well. Twisted Fate's passive makes him roll a dice every time he kills a unit, gaining between 1 and 6 gold. His Q makes him throw 3 cards that go off in different directions, with just the center one going the target's direction. His W allows him to pick a card and they all have different effects. The blue one will restore him mana when he uses it on a target, the red one will deal AoE damage and slow all targets, and the yellow one will stun targets for up to 2 seconds. His E passively grants him attack speed, and every 4th auto he'll deal extra magic damage from his autos. Finally, his ultimate will grant his team true vision of every single enemy champion in the game, and the second cast allows him to teleport to any location within some range. What makes this champion viable are his amazing roams and ganks, so push him back to prevent him from doing just that. In terms of spells, he might be playing a lot of different ones, but without a doubt, Ignite, Teleport and Heal are the most common ones in that same order. You can take Teleport to counter both his TP and Ultimate, but Ignite to finish him off in a lane or any other aggressive spell is good too. As for power spikes, as I said, his laning is pretty bad, so he doesn't get many power spikes from his early levels, but perhaps level 2 with both Q and W could work as a minor one. His level 6 is actually his main power spike. Spike. Push him to his tower to prevent him from using it, or roam when you notice he's gotten it to force it out of him. Rod of Ages is a must nowadays for him, and Lich Bane will enhance his autos after stunning even more. Thanks for tuning in, good luck in your match, and remember, he becomes quite vulnerable after using his W, so engage right after. His Q is very easy to dodge, so don't forget to do so every single time, and don't forget to call Mia whenever he disappears from the map, even if you're 99% sure he went to base. Ultimately, have fun doing it.